Okay, the level of maturity in the playing, unbelievable. It's a really great programme. Oh, thank you very much. Nice chalk, uh, choice of pieces. Truly mature, professional level ensemble playing is incredible. It was a real privilege to hear the band tonight. Thank you. It was unbelievably beautiful. The elegant ensemble, the finesse of the rhythm section, the beautifully sublime soprano playing were truly Maria Schneider's sound of well. <laughs> She would have loved it. I'm going to tweet and email her afterwards, and I'm going to recommend that she listens to the Facebook stream to fill with your play, so that she can hear you play her wonderful composition with such elegance, passion, poise and grace. It was heavenly. Bravo, everybody. A night for us all to remember. Words can't fully express the sheer magic of the ensemble's heavenly sound and glow. Um, in all the pieces, we thought it was so, there was so strong. Sorry, it's one. Shh. Could you shut the door? It's fine. Excuse me. Thanks, lovies. All of the solo with the soprano saxophone. Where's the soprano saxophone? The piano player. Flugel. Alto saxophone. <laughs> How much improvising are you doing on a regular basis? What basis? All four of you. All three of you. Four solos, three players. Are you improvising on a regular basis? No, I'm not. No? Sure. Look at that. No? Well, if you're into it, do more because already where you're at, that level of uh, improvising is really strong and mature. And also, it's um, you're very mindful of the, the sound world you're in. You're not just suddenly going, oh, and now it's me. It's actually, where are we? What is the colour and the story that we're telling? And then how can I contribute to that? And that's a very mature way of playing. So keep doing it. Thank you, Jose. Amazing. Pure spirit, fantastically lilting tempo, terrific groove and feel, um, maturely crafted ensemble play, and you're also responsive to the conductor's guiding hand. The slightest gesture is interpreted by everyone with the same level of elegance and poise, and everyone's invested into the music at the same level. Band truly plays as one, and um, subtly reinforced by the sophisticated and nuanced drumming that outlines all the details of the composition so beautifully. Where's the drum, please? Tom, are you? Yeah. Totally on it, it's like it's just very subtly just sort of showing the outline of everything. Fantastic. In fact, I thought the whole rhythm section were you were so present and yet not overstated, so that you kind of you were the heartbeat without even drawing attention to yourself. You just drove and held the pieces so beautifully. Get sassy, well all I can say is <laughs> smash it. <laughs> <laughs> that was full of personality. Um, and the, love the way that you all shared that caricature and you really wanted to sort of tell the story of that wooziness. Um, I'm not quite sure how you're all so familiar with that wooziness. <laughs> <laughs> but it was a really great one to go out on, so thank you so much, massively. Thank I you very much. I really thought it was great. Would you like to add anything, Percy? I think that's some really, really beautiful feedback, um, Izzy, really thoughtful. The only, the only thing I would... Um, knowing you really well, you lovely man. <laughs> no, you're a lovely man. No, you're the no, you're definitely. Okay, well, let's just. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 anyway. Is it? We have to go through this. It's a, it's a ceremony. It's a tradition. Um, the, the ensemble playing is just ridiculous. It's really outrageous. But I, I, just one thing I thought of, and, um, and this is biased because I'm an improviser, it's just maybe there's ways of finding more space for both. Having more, so I know it's weird here because you get 12, 12 minutes, yeah. but just generally speaking, not just the space to enable more soloists to have, have a, a you know, have a, their voice, but also within the ensemble setting. Sometimes look, I lost the flugelhorn solo because yeah. we had that round and round thing, and it, it feels like it's that like the music is contextualizing the solo rather than the ensemble is contextualizing the solo rather than the soloist. Yeah. Yeah. You see what I mean? Like the other way around. But I have a cunning plan. Um, which I've been working on, I've mentioned it. Obviously, I'm just involved now because I've left the service, so I don't have any yeah. any clout as to what, you know how things go. But what I've been doing over the last few months is looking at some of these charts and arranging them for uh, a, a nine, ten piece, which um, 
we, we, we tried it. Remember, we tried it at the last rehearsal just to see what, how that worked. It worked really lovely, as I say. I'm really pleased with it. But that's a vehicle then for being able to bring on the rhythm section and the, and the blowers in terms of looking at some focus charts over a period of maybe nine months to be able to get more embedded into the rising. Right. And then you get that communication that's off the page, that, yeah. that, that co-creativity rather than the, the, the prime focus being smashing these notes, which yeah. it's easy for you to Well, it, you know, we have a five-day course, so that the five-day course is, it's all, well, you know, you, you know, you know what it's like. It's, it, you've got the job, job of being able to get everyone familiar with the territory, with yeah. the music, and then get the ensemble tight. And it's very easy, you know, we, we, to, to not to lose, but not to give yeah. enough priority to the thing that should have the priority, and that's the language. You know, so it's it's being able to do both in a in a you know budgets are so tight nowadays. I can't so believe that what I've heard this evening is a result of five days. That is unbelievable, and the only thing that I can think, the only reason I can think it works so beautifully is that you're brilliant. And, what you did. and that everybody is then following your lead and with that same passion oh, and love. They, you, you're an amazing role model that you show that you give that commitment to the music and it'll come back again and then everyone follows suit and they've invested to that same level. Well, so that's a lovely thing to say. I'm not sure it's true. Yeah. Yeah. appreciates that already you can hear it in your playing but to um, to always be bold about communicating that verbally to other people as well that it's not something to be taken for granted what you're doing and that it's only come because you're also invested because I think sometimes people see talented young musicians play and they really don't think behind why that sounds so great and they often people take things for granted so you know be vocal about what the magical thing it is that you are doing together. And what <coughs> <coughs> So on much. that note, have a really lovely evening and a safe journey home as well. When do you all head off tomorrow morning?